in the midfield. Cole Aprico will dictate the tempo. Her positioning is going to be key to allow Van Eggman to be able to. The only tactical switch that we're going to see is Lind and Jacob switching sides. That'll allow Lind to have more of an aerial presence against the long service. Brenstrand right into Cole Aprico. Still loose in the middle. Ordonias couldn't track it down. And now advantage being played for the wave. It's Rachel Hill. Van Eggman in support. Hill keeps it moving. The shot scooped up by Campbell. Well, it's good work in the middle of the field from Carusa to be able to break free to find him. Sam Lady very happy to get Sophie Schmidt back, the experience she brings. Now this is moved off to the far side. It's Maria Sanchez, her first venture forward. Sanchez lays it off, and the shot from Vigiano is out of play. No foul called, but a dangerous free kick that Shaw's going to stand over on that far side. Ball driven in. Caruso is up for the header now. Cola Prico. And it's over the bar. To deny the opposition a lot of time and space on the ball. Morgan picks it off. Ahead for Shaw. And this one deflecting away. Campbell coming off her line. Lind was there defensively. A bit of the tempo, but then also get into the attack as well. Here's Cola Prico and Pogarsh. Plenty of options to pick out. It's aimed for Alex Morgan, and Campbell makes a big save. Long distribution there, nearly connecting. Oh, misplay by Alozia. Hill comes together. A decision here for the referee. It's a straight red card. Well, and the question will be, is if she's certainly the last line of defense, and she is, as we see that bigger picture, the right call, as Rachel Hill could have been in on goal. It looks like Didasco's moved off to that right side. As this is floated forward, it's Morgan! And it's saved again by Campbell. As you mentioned earlier, that is something that Sam Lady said they have to be mindful of. But this is just too easy. You have two center backs, Courtney Peterson, the left back actually that just came on as a substitute. Well, that they can bring in off the bench. Westfall right through the legs of Vigiano, and here's Shaw. Jaden Shaw trying to take it herself, went for the curler, and put it out of play that red card in the first half to Alozia. So they're going to have to find their moments when they're going to go be more direct and try to play. This one curled into a dangerous area down in front. And Hill just couldn't get a touch on it. Down, loads of bodies inside the six yard box and three around Alex Morgan. That means Hill is completely open and that doesn't miss her by much as Alex Morgan does well to win the initial ball, trying to knock it down on frame. Does look like it comes off of a Houston dash play. Ogarsh for Shaw. Shaw trying to race away from Schmidt. That's a foul and a yellow card will come with it as well. Shaw going for goal. Campbell bats it down and then is able to hold on to it. Not behind the run of Van Egmond. Here's Schmidt. Maybe a chance to release Garris down the left. Ryan Garris all alone. And Garris, that was really all, the only option she had. Sheridan, the back line of San Diego, is just going to have to be mindful of those moments not to get caught. Hill, early ball in, it's Morgan off the crossbar. Great delivery from the right side, they'll go again. Hill trying to connect. With and Rachel Hill has been excellent on that right hand side in the second half so far. Little cut, quick combination play. There's the first attempt from Alex Morgan, just hits that one off the crossbar, takes it well. The best opportunity is to wreck. They go with numbers. There's a commitment to go quickly. 
And they go again, the header's down, and this time wide. And Jaden Shaw can't believe it. They regain possession, find Rachel Hill again, and then wide open inside the 18-yard box once again. It's Didasco that's trying to come across. Really just needed to get something on it to keep it on frame to force the save for Campbell, but that one trickles wide. Here's Morgan. Alex Morgan off the post! Two times off the woodwork for Morgan. That time just strikes it well from distance. Hits the post. Trying to connect with Shaw. Van Eggmans turning it back. Space centrally. Here's Shaw. Shaw is in. Shaw! She scores! That's Jaden Shaw's goal. And San Diego is broken through. Defensive pressure, they're going centrally, they're going out wide. This time it's Van Eggman that regains the possession and just the control to be able to build up, allow for more attackers. But look at the little move from Jaden Shaw, just the hesitation right there. Looks like she's going to go with the outside of her foot, says no, I'm going to go in line. Bates Jane Campbell. I'll go again down that right side. Jakobsen. To the back post, Carusa stands it up. Carusa gets it right back. It's saved by Campbell. Jakobsen attacks it. Yes, they're down a player, but have to get touched tight once the ball is re-entered into the 18-yard box. Jakobsen all the way to the back side. It's put back. It's saved off the line. Didasco <laughs> keeps it out. Here's the sequence again. Oh, wow. And they've had a lot of success down this right-hand side in the second half. Jakobsen coming on. What a save that is from Didasco. Perfect positioning from the right back as Caruso knew the angle was tight. Presence of mind by being touched tight and then finding out that pass to get into the mix. It's Morgan, and that's cleared away. For Alex Morgan, that one blocked down two times off the woodwork. And they'll go again. Caruso, Caruso went for power, spilled in front. It's a double save for Jane Campbell. Great combination play. Megan DeHorty Howard coming out of the midfield. Didasco has to make the decision to step over. That allows for the gap to open up. There's a shot from Caruso. Megan DeHorty Howard. Jakobsen cuts it in. Jakobsen going for goal. It's pushed away again by Jane Campbell. In the wide areas. And then the eight players for the Houston Dash are just dropping back. No real pressure. And it's broken up. Schmidt is brought down. This might be a yellow card coming with it. It is a yellow card to Sophia Jakobsen. There's Jordy Howard. Let's run all the way through. Doniak. Korniak going from distance. And eyes for that top corner, but it's out of play. Doniak. Right at Didasco, Doniak had saved at that near post by Campbell. And another corner kick for San Diego. Hogarsh lofts it in, Korniak's up for it, and it's right at Campbell. It's for Houston, three of their final four games will be on the road against teams, though, right around them in the standings. This is moved out wide. Jakobsen pushed in front. It's cleared away and then cleared off the line. The clearance went right to Alex Morgan, who cannot buy a goal tonight. She can't believe it. And the flag is up for offside. Yeah, but all the credit to, to the dash, because going down to 10 players, the amount of defending, the credit to, to the dash, because going down to 10 players, the amount of defending that they've had to do in this second half especially, but 
You see Sophie Schmidt go to ground. Lynn get beyond Jane Campbell as she came off for line. Jacobs. Pushing the back on Jacobs. We kick to San Diego. Morgan goes quick over the top. Here's Doniak. Doniak over the bar. Just went for it herself. In this game, good ball over the top early on from Alex Morgan in that last attempt. Doniak. Doniak in the side netting. And as the stats update, that should be the 30th shot of the game. Recognition of where the space was to initiate the attack, drive into the midfield as we're going to hear the final whistle. That is it. It's three points to the San Diego Wave and to the top of the table.